Hello everyone and welcome to DNP Online tutorial videos on setting up DNP Online. My name is Magdana and I'm Customer Development Manager for DNP Online. In a case you don't know what DNP Online is, well, DNP Online is Digital Curation Center's data management planning tool. It provides tailored guidance and example answers to help researchers develop data management plans and the tool can be customized so you can add your own templates and guidance. In order to customize the tool, you need to have administrator privileges for your institution. These videos are aimed for the administrators, where I'll walk you through setting up DMP online, creating guidance, templates, customizing founder templates, review usage, themes, and we'll be covering special features in the later videos. Today, I'll start a series with the introduction videos. The first one is on how to create an account and I'll show you what the admin interface looks like. First, let's create an account. So you'll have to go to dmponline.dcc.ac.uk and in a case you don't have an account, you will have to click here on create an account. You'll fill this with your details. And in a case your organization is not listed, you, you can just type the name of your organization here and we'll add it to the list or feel free to email us directly to dmponline at dcc.ac.uk and we'll do that for you. I already have my account, so I'll just log in in here. And I have been now moved to the admin interface. The admin interface um, differentiates from the user interface by the fact that you'll be able to see this admin tab in here um, with access to different things. And in this video, I'll just explain to you what these really stand for. So um, once you click on plans and in here, uh, this will provide access to all institutional data management plans. And you can view individual plans and download metadata on them all. Then you have the templates in here, and this one allows you to create your own templates and customize founder templates. I haven't created any yet, so this is empty, but we'll do that in the later videos. In guidance, this one allows you to create theme guidance to apply across all the templates in the tool. Again, you can see this is empty for me, um, but we'll be changing this in the later videos as well. Organizational details allows you to edit your profile by adding logos and links and enable the DMP feedback and review option. Users allows you to see details for all users in your organization. And the last one, usage, provides statistics on the number of users and plans created per month by users in your organization. In the next DMP Online introduction videos, I'll explain how to grant administrator privileges for other users in your organization. Goodbye.